Okay, now we have 4.1 times 10 to the negative 4 times 8.5 times 10 to the 7. And then later we're going to work on this question over here. So let's start with 4.1 times 8.5, which is equivalent to 34.85. And now we can combine the tens. We have 10 to the negative 4 times 10 to the 7. Because we're just multiplying the tens, we can add the exponents. Negative 4 plus 7 is just 3. So 10 to the negative 4 times 10 to the 7 is just 10 to the 3. Now we're almost done. However, the 34.85 is not in scientific notation. We want to bring the decimal over here. And to do that, we're going to have to multiply it by 10 to the power of 1. Right? Because we just went one decimal place to the left. So we multiply by 10 to the 1. And of course we still have the 10 to the 3 over here. We're also multiplying everything by the 10 to the 3. 10 cubed. So now we just need to combine the tens. So we have 3.485 times 10 1 plus 3, 4. And that's it. What about this question? Now we're dividing. So that's going to be pretty similar. We have 8.1 divided by 4.3, which is 1.8. Um, I'm just going to write 8.8. .8. I'm just going to go for two decimal places here. And we're going to multiply by 10 to the power of negative 4 minus 7. We're dividing, so we subtract the exponents. Negative 4 minus 7 is negative 11. And because we only have one digit before the decimal, this is already in scientific notation, and we're done. That's it.